So today, we have two of the strongest beings in all of comics going head to head. Hawk versus Hercules. Who wins? Let's find out. So, as, the, as Zeus's son, he Hercules possesses the powers of an Olympian god, such as godlike strength, their ability, speed, reflexes, and stamina. He is the strongest of the Olympian gods. He held the weight of the heavens, which is said to be unmeasurable and incalculable. He's also overpowered Thor and stalemated with the strongest versions of the Hulk. He can run over 100 miles per hour and leap 100 feet into the air. He can withstand blows from Hawk, Thor, and Zeus, his own father, and powerful lightning blasts from Zeus, and powerful energy blasts from cosmic level beings like Galactus. Uh, he is an expert combatant. He's actually created his own fighting style that's a combination of Greco-Roman wrestling and Greco-Roman boxing. He's also a very brutal fighter as well. He's resistant to all earthly diseases, has a nice healing factor, and is virtually immortal, and he has some immunity to magic as well. And in the other cor corner, we have Hawk. After he was exposed to a large amounts of gamma radiation while trying to save someone, Dr. Bruce Banner turned into the Green Goliath, known as the Incredible Hawk. He is the embodiment of strength and rage. His strength is forever increasing as it increases with his emotions, most notably rage. He has one of the best healing factors in the Marvel Universe and comics ever. He heals from almost any and every attack instantly, no matter if it's physical, mystical, uh, energy blast, whatever. He can run up to 300 miles per hour, leap into Earth's orbit from the ground, and can leap across states and small countries. He has amazing, he has many amazing strength feats, like overpowering Thor, holding two tectonic plates together, which means he virtually held the earth together, because it's like a puzzle, and he held a mountain range that weighed 150 billion tons. Also, his punches move at the speed of sound, which is 770 miles per hour while in battle. So, these are two of the strongest heroes in all of Marvel. Now, let's talk about strength last. So, who's more durable? Well, I'm going to give the advantage to Hawk due to his better healing factor, but Hercules should not be underestimated and is very durable as well. Surprisingly, they're very close in terms of speed. Hawk is actually fast, has faster running speed, but Hercules is faster with like reflexes and in combat, as he is tagged Sentry and the Silver Surfer while they were flying at the speed of light or faster before. So, now, uh, and Hercules is not only the better fighter, but a brutal fighter as well. So now, the big question, who is stronger? Strength is the most important factor in this fight. They're both in the top three strongest heroes in Marvel, along with Sentry. Hercules has overpowered Thor, still made it with the strongest versions of Hulk, and lifted the weight to the heavens, which is said to be incalculable and unmeasurable, but Hawk has held two tectonic plates together, held a mountain range that weighed 150 billion tons, and did a thunderclap with such force that it ripped a hole in time and space in reality. I think it's safe to say that Hercules is stronger than Hawk's base level and could probably win early with his skill, but he loves a good fight and will draw this fight out just because he loves it and he knows Hawk will bring him a good fight, so he won't end it early. That's going to lead to Hercules' downfall, because Hawk's going to get pissed as it progresses on, and his strength will continuously increase to the point that he can just overpower him. And at that point, there's going to be nothing keeping Hawk from getting this win. Hawk wins. Like and subscribe, all the great stuff. See you on the next one. Peace. Hit the bell next to the subscribe button.